Hello, this is Coach Kendra Kanoy coming to you from Cape Town. And I was having a conversation with a friend and client who had finished the 30-day program a month or so ago. And we were talking about how she was doing. And we, uh, she talked about her social life and how she does well most of the time, but there's so many events and, of course, a lot of wine and all sorts of things. So it reminded me that I have a short list of party tips and tricks, and this time of year is a good time to review those so that you can be prepared with all of the social activities that you have. Um, so there's five of them. So number one is the 80-20 rule, and this is something that we talk about post 30-day program of no matter what uh, effects you found from certain sorts of, of inflammatory foods, whether or not they cause any symptoms in you, uh, regardless, you want to stay away from those 80% of the time. So 20% of the time, you can get a little dirty, have a little fun. <laughs> um, and what that means, if you are having three meals a day, seven days a week, 21 meals a week, so 20% of that would only be four meals a week. And that, I think, is, is something that people really have to um, reframe because some people tend to take Friday evening all the way through Sunday and just do whatever. But really, you want to choose four meals. So you have to look at what events you have during the week, what on the weekends, and you know structure that. Even within your meal, if you know you're going to have alcohol, maybe keep the food um, entirely free of inflammatories. Or if you're not, then maybe you want to choose dessert or whatever it is so that you're really conscious about what you're choosing. So sticking with that in general, and especially during um, holiday party season. And then having protein. So there are plenty of carbs available. Most events have you know crackers and cheese and sweets and things like that. So those are all going to fall into the, the carbohydrate category. So sometimes if I know that that's what's all, all that's going to be available, I'll have a quick protein shake or a piece of chicken or something before I leave the house so that at least I'm filling up on that before I get to the carbs and the sugar. <laughs> um, and then the third one is to have fiber before, especially before drinking alcohol or just eating a lot of sweets. Because fiber, in addition to helping you with di your digestive tract, it also binds with sugars and slows down the absorption of sugar. So it's actually better for your blood sugar balance if you do it that way. Um, number four is is my personal favorite hangover cure. This is not a scientific uh, <laughs> measurement, but I found that a combination of detox tea, a fizz energy drink, and there's a new product called Mind Health. And if you're interested in this, I can shoot you over um, some information on it with the ingredients. It's four other things, but I found that it does give a nice little boost to the brain if you have had a few cocktails. Uh, so go ahead and put your favorite drink emoji or just shoot me a DM if you want information on that. Um, but having those, and that's also going to make sure you're really hydrated. Remember that detox tea or anything with milk thistle, milk thistle is a herb that is made to help your, not made to, but it helps your liver and kidney flush more efficiently. And then lastly is to stick with your workout and your sleep routine. So holidays, we tend to be staying up later some nights. And that might make you want to sleep in and not, you know, skip your workout. But really the most that you can stick with the workout regimen and get proper sleep. So if you know you have an event on Saturday night, just try on Friday and Sunday to make sure that you're getting good quality sleep and going to bed a little bit earlier. Because that's going to help your whole system just stay on track. And of course, we all know that when we're tired and if you're hungover, then you're going to be making more of the choices to go get the burgers and fries because that does sound delicious when you're hungover. <laughs> so those are some, just some quick party tips and tricks. If you have any other ones that I have forgotten or don't know about, I'd appreciate you sharing. And if you like this video, share it with your friends, especially those who you know you're going to be going to a lot of holiday parties with. All right. Have a great day. I'll talk to you soon.